Okay, so I'm a star, and okay, the only thing that you should be doing right now is listening and doing what I do. Okay, because I'm sick of having to explain how to use VBA Link and Hamachi correctly over and over and over again. And okay, so if you follow this video correctly, you should have no issues whatsoever, and that's it. Okay, just don't, don't even see, because if you do, I'm literally going to go and kill you with my wiggly tough. So anyway, uh, so you're gonna go to your internet browser. I go to Google Chrome because Google Chrome is the best, and I go to Hamachi download as uh, Google search, and then I get to this page right here. After this, it'll uh, free download. Okay, and then ask to you know. It's gonna download and stuff. You wanna save this and keep it somewhere where you'll know where it is because you'll probably use it again at some time. So you're gonna go to run and then go to English, you know, install Hamachi. Um, I already have it, so I'm just gonna reinstall it. Remember to save this somewhere where you know where it is and yeah. Um, there, launch Hamachi. And uh, then Hamachi should open right there. And it says probing. In the meantime, the Hamachi network that you need to join, and the only one you need to join, this is the only one you need to join. And like, seriously, when you have issues, you, you'll have issues if you go and try to join a whole bunch of different networks. A lot of people don't know that. But, um, yeah, so just do this. Just join this network, Jared, third gen, like that, and then pass one, two, three. Jared has a premium network, like a cool guy, which means that he's not going to have any issues when it comes to, you know, a limited amount of people joining his stuff, and this is everyone in here. There's a lot of people in here, so don't go everywhere and try to do whatever because you don't need to, okay? This is the only place you need to go, and if you want to battle someone, then just tell them to go here and nowhere else because that will have connection issues and stuff. So then after this, you want to go back to your internet browser and then go to... VBA link, download, you'll go to this page, by the way I'll put all this stuff in my description so you don't have to go die, you want to download the 1.8 Wi-Fi edition, here it is right here, what you want to do is go and extract it, well, I already did, it's right there, and uh, once you extract it you have that, here's VBA, and here's VBA, now you need, welcome my name bro, now you're going to go to pool ROMs, there and then you're gonna go here and then you're gonna download okay uh, wait for it to download what you should do after you get this it'll be a zip file but then all you got to do is just extract it and um, so yeah and after you extract it um, all you got to do since I already have it uh, we're just gonna stop this because we can and um, go to your VBA go to open go to Pokemon Emerald and open it okay now you probably don't have a save, or you probably do, whatever, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to, um, on, Emerald, save. Here's a save that someone had made, his name is Polar Bear, I know this guy, he's pretty cool. All you got to do is just go to this one, it's Polar Bears. It's, it's right there. And all you got to do is download, it's going to be PokemonEmerald.o.s, you know, SPS. And after that, once this opens, um, the only thing you got to do is just go to, um, once it opens, Go to File, um, Import, Game Shark Snapshot, and then Import the save file. There it is. I mean, it's it's not. This guy has a whole bunch of stuff on his PC, and it's not it's not complicated. I mean, he has a whole bunch of stuff, and that's all you need to do to be set in regards to you know battling people and stuff. So there you go. Um, if you still need video, you know, not uh, video stuff, but um, editing stuff for editing your Pokemon, you can always get um, Pokemon Encyclopedia, which is what I use, or you can get Star Wars Pokemon Maker. I can put those both in the description. If you need to know how to use those, that's a different video. Go somewhere else, because it's not here. Okay, so what you're going to do is uh, on your VBA, um, where, where, wherever it is, I, I can't find it. I think I closed it already, but oh well. All you're going to do is just... Um, in order to connect to someone, you're going to have to make sure that the options are like this. Frame skip, zero, and all that stuff, unless you have a completely slow computer. No throttle, um, video, and um, these are all your things right here. I'm going to keep it there for a second. You can pause and copy these because you might need to copy those. Um, and there you go. 
Afterwards, you're just gonna go to link, make sure wireless adapter is checked, go to settings, and uh, make sure network is like this. I'll leave all this stuff alone right here, it's okay. And if you're gonna be the server, then do that. And the other person, if they're gonna be the client, they need to connect to you and your IP. In order to find someone's IP, you gotta go into this list and copy their IP version 4 address, and then you'll uh, copy it and put it right there. Um, my IP is that, but I can just put localhost since it's myself, and then I'll connect, and that's it. Okay, um, that's that's all you gotta do, and then you just go into the game and open it. It's not really hard, like it's it's not. So you, you know, I mean, seriously, people make it too much. It's it's not. Um, as I said, um, there's only a couple of games that work like this. Um, our only game of focus is Pokemon Emerald. Now this is extremely important. I want you to only use Emerald for this. Do not use Fire Red. Do not use Leaf Green. Those games are unstable and uh, Emerald is a lot more useful and it's not going to die as much as um, you know, as uh, Fire Red and Leaf Green do. Then once again, do not use Fire Red or Leaf Green. I'm sorry, you're just going to have to give it up. Use Emerald not fire red and leaf green. I'm sorry, that's that's just what's gonna have to be like. Okay, I mean, what other issues could you possibly have if you if you um if it, if you load Hibachi, then it says um, tunnel uh, tunneling engine has stopped working or something. All you gotta do is go to settings control panel, and all you gotta do is just go to add or remove programs and uninstall Hamachi and reinstall it. That's all you gotta do. That's all you gotta do. That's all you gotta do. Please, just don't, don't. Okay, that's all you gotta do. Don't make, don't make it too much. Like seriously, log me in Hamachi and just uninstall it and reinstall it. It's not that hard, okay. There should be no more issues with this. Um, make sure your person has to, uh, like, you know, this. Make sure they have, you know, and if uh, frame skip zero is too much, then you can always go to uh, frame skip number two. It's not going to be as good as the quality, but yeah. If you want to record battles, just always know that there's a versus recorder, and you could always just use that. It's not complicated. That's all your most of your battles should be with a versus recorder, unless you're paranoid and you want to, you know, you can record when a battle starts, um, like a cool guy. But uh, it's not recommended because stopping your VBA anytime isn't recommended at all. Okay, so that's all you need to do. If you happen to have any questions at all, you shouldn't. But if you happen to have some, then you can just tell me and I'll try to help you as easily as I can. I mean, this was a quick tutorial. It's not really all that hard. I'll put the links in the description. And there's nothing else that you really need to know. Okay, so um, thank you for, like, I guess watching. And just don't have issues with it. It's, it's not all that. And I'm just going to try this out and see if this works. Um, no. mm, okay, I just want to see what that did. Okay, alright, awesome. Thank you for watching. Bye.